it going? So I have my Ask Missy for my YouTube up right now and let's get looking at those uh, questions. So the first question I have here is from Lindsay Brady asking if you were stuck in a room with a wild animal what would that animal be or what would I want that animal to be? Well I live with a cat, so she's pretty cray cray and why wild and stuff like that. So I don't know. I mean, I think it'd be cool to like have like a monkey or or a lemur or something like that. I don't know. I, I really have no idea. So I think that would be kind of cool to be stuck in a room with like a, a lemur or something foofy and cool, like a panda bear. Yeah, I'll be stuck in a room with a panda bear. Nat Future asked me. Why did you choose to dye your hair red out of all of uh, the colors? Um, I chose red because I just wanted to do red. I've done my hair the whole rainbow before, so it's not that big of a deal. But it is the first time I've ever dyed my, you know, and bleached my whole head red. I've had red just in the front. I've had it, you know, stuff like that, but... So I'm going to try this out for like a year or two and then I will do something else with it possibly. I don't know. I, I haven't decided what I'm going to do next though. So uh, that's, that's why and because apparently this red really likes to stick well. So because I got a nice red that sticks well and I don't like the fact how blue fades. I don't like how green fades. I don't like how sometimes the pink can fade. Um, I'm not really into the pastel colors at all lately, so chose red because it's just a dominant primary color that's just really cool. So, yeah. Uh, Melody Hamilton asked me, "What's my favorite food?" It is linguine alfredo from Red Lobster. It is like my favorite food ever. My, you know, just favoriteest food of all time. That's my favorite. Jenny Flynn asked me. I know I asked a question on your Jan Ask Missy via Twitter, but I but I saw you recently touched up your roots, and I was actually wondering how hard it was to get the color so dark into the black brown hair. I have uh, dark brown hair, and I wanted to put a light purple in it. No need to answer on camera if you don't want to. Thanks. Well. It is for my uh, February Ask Missy, so I'm going to answer it on the camera, obviously, if I just read your question out. Um, bleach. I bleach my hair. It is very, very bad for your hair to fully bleach it completely. Um, but that is what I use to touch up my hair, is bleach. That's how I get the color to stay, is bleach. Victim of Sanity. Ever thought of doing any other colors for your hair other than red? Yes, I have done the rainbow, I've done raccoon, I've done zebra, I've done, uh, I've done pink and purple, I've done highlights, low lights, uh, frosted, I've, I've literally done my hair the whole rainbow, and black. Why do you do these ask videos so often. I do these every single month because it's fun and I really want to, you know, and that's what I really want my channel to kind of do all the time is those every single month. So that way for like a week straight you have those questions. So I just think it's fun for me personally and I like to know what other people like to say and it's also a way for me to communicate better with the fans is by them asking me questions and I can answer them for them and um, because I have no other way for them to contact me at all because I shut my kick off because of harassment and threats and stuff like that. So that is why I do these so often. I do them monthly. So you're going to see these every single month. <laughs> um, favorite band slash music genre. Um, favorite band music genre. You know, I listen to a lot of music nowadays. I've... I don't really even have a favorite band anymore, to be honest with you. Um, I, I wish I could go see more artists. Uh, actually, no. There is a band right now that I, that I do like. I saw them when I went to go see Flogging Molly. 
uh, is the t-shirt that I'm wearing that I actually got from the Flogging Molly concert. And they are called the Pasadena Band, or Pasadena. These guys are amazing. They're really, really cool. I like them a lot. Um, and I think it'd be totally cool if I actually got to do some music with those guys. I mean, mind it, I have never done music on my channel. But a lot of people think that I should, but I don't want that to be surrounded, you know? My, my channel to be surrounded by that. But, right now, and they're just kind of, they're... They're really cool. They're like, I don't really know, they're kind of like an alternative uh, rock band or punkish a little bit, but they're also more mainstream slash reggae sometimes. I mean, they have their own style. It's really cool and that's why I like them. Um, let's see. Whenever I see your username, I think of J. Von Monroe. Does that have to do with anything with your username or the story behind it, your username? Obviously, you can see me rolling my eyes because I absolutely hate that guy. I've had my name my whole life. Then a person that's just because he's famous because he's in a band that I don't even like. Everybody thinks that I'm copying that when it's definitely not true. So... There is your answer. That is literally my name. I'm not stealing it from anybody. Marilyn Monroe really is in my real name. I mean, I'm not kidding. Like, I am named after Marilyn Monroe. So, don't think that anything is going to get twisted because, trust me, uh-uh. I was, I've had that name longer than that guy has ever thought of his name. So, just saying. Alrighty. Uh... Ariana Duran, ha or, uh, okay, she has like a, ah, she's got like a, a question that's separated, I'm guessing, uh, asking, have I ever been bullied and, or had separation, had a separation from your parents? Uh, my parents are still married. They've been married, I think, for like almost 30 plus ish more years. I'm not too sure how long they've been married, but they've been, they're, they're still married. And I've been bullied, but I dealt with it. And I was always the type that I came back and then I actually got the respect because people just did it to be rude and mean. And because they knew that nobody would stand up for themselves till I came along and I kind of stood up for that. And to make a point, it was during the first week of high school, and it was showing, like, uh, senior power, freshman power, sophomore power, junior power, stuff like that. You know, it's like power week, whatever. Um, showing your class, stuff like that. Um, this senior kid thought it was funny to just shove me in a, uh, in a trash can. So the next day, I came back with duct tape, and I ducked him, duct taped him to the, uh, senior senior lockers and I also wrote freshman power all over him in the in while well, taping him up to the uh, lockers and I kind of got my respect and I hung out with a lot of juniors and a lot of seniors my whole entire time when I was in high school and um, I had people that were friends in my own class uh, and stuff like that but I got a lot of respect from that I did not like it when people were bullying my friends however uh, I had quite an issue and I'd always tell them, hey, knock it off, they didn't deserve that, that's really mean, and then they would always apologize. So, I mean, I got, I had to earn my respect, and I know that's not how it is nowadays. Because remember, I was in high school in 2007, that whole, like, the new bullying thing, that's, that was new right when I started to graduate high school in 2011. And people didn't make a huge deal about it till like, literally 2000. 12 to 2013 so the new bullying now I've had that before I don't like it just as much however I tend to just ignore it more because that's what I do and it's not that big of a deal and I really think that real bullying with actually having somebody make physical harm to you to make you feel uncomfortable so I mean that's just my opinion but you know Everybody's opinion is different. Um, Trinity Marshall asked me, how many years until you're out of cosmetology? Also, how did you learn to do hair and makeup? 
I actually was self-taught on the hair and makeup thing, and I am actually graduating this year, November 15th. So, I'm only going to school for a year, guys, and I'm gonna have my license. So, I'm already doing my freshman stuff and uh, my freshman practical and all that stuff, and I'm already on the floor, I just need to get the clients next, so that's what I've been doing. Um, but yeah, so only one year, 1,700 hours, that's 1,700 hours, so I thought that was cool. Um, Kelly Robles asked me, what's your favorite team and what's your favorite color? My favorite color is the rainbows. Now, I don't know about the team thing because there's a whole bunch of teams. I mean, like, there is baseball, soccer, football, um, rugby, there's, there's tennis, there's volleyball, there's... I mean, there are so many teams out there that it's ridiculous. I mean, it depends on what sport. Uh, I, I don't really know who I could classify in, like, those sports, I guess, you know, or what kind of sport, because I, I like a lot of other people. Like, I like the Atlanta Falcons, for example. Uh, I like, even though that the Seattle Mariners are my home team, uh, I'm sorry, but Boston Red Sox, New York Yankees, come on now.